Yeah, thank you for your response. Thank you so much. So we do have two topics for today. The first topic, topic is going to be about network connection. And then the second one, which is going to be about basic wiring of the Envy's device. So let's start with the first one first. So I'm using the my, our face tip three to do the demo. Regarding to the face tip three, it's supporting two kind of the communication method. One is the uh, one is the Wi-Fi, the other one which is the Ethernet. So if you're using some other device, I believe, and Ethernet and also Wi-Fi both are supported. So. Uh, all our Linux device is going to be very similar interface. You can see it. If you want to go to the setup for a network, you need to go to the main menu and select the network settings. Then it will be available for you. You can see the Ethernet and also the Wi Fi selection for you. The second step is you need to select your web mode. If you are using the Ethernet, make sure you need to go to internet setting first and select the Ethernet as your web mode. And then you need to go to your Ethernet settings to finish your Ethernet IP mode setup, uh, either the DHCP or static, it depends on your local network. Regarding to my PowerPoint, I'm using the static at the moment. So once you finish the Ethernet settings, so it will be automatically online. And however, if you're using the Wi-Fi, uh, you need to go to the network menu and go to the net internet again, and switch the internet settings, which is a web mode from the Ethernet to the Wi-Fi. We'll see on the next page. So as you can see, once you select internet, on the web mode, you have to select as a Wi-Fi. So you can think as this way, every time you have to keep a same page, you're using the Wi-Fi until you select as a Wi-Fi as your web mode. However, if you're using the Ethernet, you have to make sure you're selecting Ethernet as your web mode. And let's go to the next page. So once you finish the Ethernet settings with your Wi-Fi, and you need to go to the Wi-Fi settings, and you need to choose the Wi-Fi first and then select the Wi-Fi, the proper Wi-Fi and add it. And once you finish the instant settings, you can check on the left column. If you're using some other finger fingerprint device, it makes you on the top. But no matter which device you have, you can see, so there's a sign. The first sign is showing, so it's using Ethernet. Uh, the third one is showing it's using the Wi-Fi there. So if it's showing the red mark or exclamation mark, it means something is wrong with your network. You need to check your network again. So let's go to the second topic for today. The second one, which is going to be about basic wiring of Envy's device. So we do have turnstile tables on the back. You can see. So on the back side, so there's the turnstile cables. You can see it. So on the last page, I will show everyone how it works. So regarding to the power supply of the device, we do have two kinds of power adapters. For some of the device, it's using the five volts, one A, or the some other one, which is power, uh, which is 12 volts and two ampage, depends on which device you are using. And please check your stack and statics first before uh, power up the device. So the next one, if uh, you're using our access control device, so there's access control power supply you can see on it. So which is the first two, which is 12 volts and GND, you need to power up the device with these two things that's here. 
So this is a demo for uh, our P7, I believe so. So here's the interface for our access control systems for our phase deep three. You can see it, the first two are 12 volts and the GND and W01 and W1, WI1. Sorry, so it goes too fast. So you can see the second and third two columns, which is about our output and also input for our weekends. And the third, uh, fourth and fifth column, which is gonna be about bell and also the GND at the bottom. And on the left, on the right, it will be about the, uh, the bell active power and also exit button on the, on the right. And then will be the NO and NC on the right. You will see it's coming with different colors. So basically it's our schematic. So you can see, and also there's a label and also tags on the back. You can also check on your device. So don't worry about this part. So here's the simple wiring with the power supply and also the DOS switch you can see on it. So it's gonna be about the power up, um, giving the power and then using the exit buttons and then using the, the NC logic and also the COM. So for my device, I was using the NC for the wirings. I made some dot switch for everyone already. You can see it. So just give me one second. I will show the demo to everyone. So now you can see the green light is on. So that means it, the, the door has been locked already. And once I scan my face, the, the door lock will be released. Thank you. Here we go. So everyone can see, so it's been released already. So what, let's do one more time. So you can hear the sound that the lock has been released. So basically it's very simple wiring I did. It's coming with the dry connections. The one part which is the voltage, uh, the positive is gonna go with the power. The other side, which has go with the, with the, the calm, calm side and also the other one, which is, which is an old logic. Let's go back to the, Go back to the power adapter. So basically, so that's my wiring. It's very simple wiring. So any anyone if some have some concern or question about wiring, just let me know. Leave the uh, note or the question on the chat so I will solve everyone's problems there. So we do have the wet connection and also the dry connections. So everyone, is, feel free to ask. Here we go. So here's our today's session for today. And uh, so let me make a conclusion for everything at here. So the first one, which, which is gonna be about network connections and the second one, which is simple wirings. Um, yes, yeah, so today's training is almost done for it. And uh, if you everyone have the concern or the question, so just leave the notes, I can know and solve your questions at the moment. 
So I'm going to leave about five minutes for the for the question time. So everyone, feel free to ask. So it's pretty simple for the network settings. And so if you have some device, you meet some problems with your network settings or the network configurations, so just let me know. And I could try to help you at the moment. And so just kind of a reminder for everyone, later on we're gonna release different uh, training sessions for our device. And so it's gonna be about every Wednesday, I believe so, or two, uh, the Thursday. And so I will available on the website. 